In this video, I have a very quick responsive design tip for you, and this is regarding text elements and spacing uh, when you have text elements doing different things based on the screen width. So for example, I've got this dummy text here. It's a handful of sentences, fills out this nice little block here, and I have a button right below it. And I want to maintain the spacing between the top of the button and the bottom of this text element, no matter what screen width I'm at. So if I go to my responsive mode here, I'm going to close that, and I can see that when I make the screen a little bit tighter, the spacing is still good. Um, they maintain their um, the distance between the bottom here and the top of the button there. But if I go wider on this screen, see how now there is much more uh, white space between the bottom of the text, the end of the text, and the top of this button. That's because the wider my screen goes, the more room there is uh, for text to fit on a single line. So things are shifting up and it's creating this extra space here. Well, how do I get rid of that? Because now I have this uneven spacing between the text and the button. Very, very quick little checkbox that you just need to take care of here. It's this one, shrink if text gets shorter. You can check that there and you can see instantly how Bubble just kind of cut off all of that extra white space because it's not needed, right? It's basically compressing the text element um, if it doesn't need to be as tall. So now I can move um, to any screen width and that spacing will be the same no matter what width your users are viewing your application on. You can access this checkbox from the responsive mode down here once you select the text element. You can also access this from your regular UI builder. Uh, select open up the property editor for the uh, text element. Mine's not opening, there it is. And it's right here, same checkbox. Okay, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I upload videos every single week. Thanks so much for watching.